What is up, what's up, what is up, FS Club, welcome back to the channel, welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator 21 Let's Play, Episode 5. Well, the last video, guys, we actually took something from the junkyard and actually completely rebuilt it and made actually a really good profit on it. About, think about like 35 to about $30,000 extra, I believe. But anyways, today, guys, what we're going to be doing with that money is we're going to go look at a bar and see if we can actually find something to flip to. Oh yeah, we are at level 13. Uh, do I have anything I can upgrade? Let's see. No, just one on that. And yeah, I want to keep the money for that. Okay, right, first of all, what we're going to have to do is we need to go over there. Do I have anything to get rid of? Let's get rid of these rubber bushings real quick. Anything else? No. Okay, so we got, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 barns. Jeez. All right, let's just click the first one. Yes. All right, let's go right over to here. And where are we at? Barn, 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 barn. One right there. Okay, this is our first ever barn in the game. Let's go. Okay, I know it's actually been a little bit since I posted a Let's Play on this. Just been really busy. And then, of course, yesterday I took a float trip, got burnt, and now we're back. All right, let's see what we can find here. Please be something good. Okay, wow, definitely a barn. I just got a trophy. That's what that pop-up was. Oh, there's the first. Ooh, look at that thing right there. And we also have another car right there. Um, Let's see, what do we all have? I don't see nothing over here. Some parts. Uh, ooh, a tr let's fix up a truck. How much is this thing? Let's see how much they're selling it for. Eighteen three, eighteen thousand dollars. Three hundred sixteen thousand miles, though. This is a fifty-five, though. Oh, that would be something really good. I bet you we can get a really good price for that after we fix it all up. All right, let's see that. See more junk. Okay, I think we're gonna have a choice between those three cars. There's nothing over here. I'm re I'm really leaning toward the Salem right there. Okay, yeah, I don't see anything else. So it's either the Salem or what was the other two? We have this one right here, which is a Delray Custom, a 57. This one has only 230,000 miles on it. Ooh, but the pride price on that is 35,000. Yeah, we're staying away from that thing for right now. And then we have a newer looking car right here. This is a 2003 Mayan M8, which only has 146,000 miles. And it's 29,000. It's probably because it's got a lot of the original. Yeah, look at that. It's got a lot of the original parts in there. Let me see this one right here. Yeah, well, it's missing actually quite a bit. How much is the other one missing? Let's go right over there real quick. Uh, where are you at? I think it was right there it is. Okay, let's open up that hood real quick. Oh, it's missing a lot. But the price we can get for restoring this thing... It might outweigh it. Uh, let me actually go over to here, examination mode. Okay, I know we're pretty much it's going to have to repair pretty much everything. Let's see, a lot of arms we're going to have to replace, air filters, air filter, clutch pressure plates. Um, let's see, clips, I don't care about the clips. Radiator fan, crankshaft, I'm just really seeing what we actually have in here. Okay, we have a fuse box, I mean, guess that's a plus. Suspension, let's see. Front wheel hub. Sway bar. Definitely going to have to repair the whole body. Okay, there's that. One, two, three on this. Looks like it's missing a muffler over there. Let me do that. Yeah, it's definitely missing a muffler. Then we got the suspension over here. Going to need a new cross member. Uh, the drive shaft, definitely going to probably need... Oh, it's actually not too bad. 52%. Oh, yeah, what about this expansion? You're going to need a fuel pump. Doesn't even have one. And then let's go over to the next side. Let's do that. I think this is what we're going to be getting. Oh, I'm going to be able to fit over there. Yeah, there we go. One, two, three. So I believe everything that's over 15%, well, most things, you can actually try to repair yourself, so... Got some tie rods. Yeah, I think this is the one we're gonna get. Alright, so let me go like this real quick. There we go. 
Okay, sorry about that. I actually take the screenshot for it. So uh, let's go ahead and get. The okay, hold on one second. I just want to check something out. Oops, wrong button. Uh, back there. Buy car. So this is a Salem 1500, and they said what 18,000 for this one. So Salem 1500. Hopefully, I'm not messing up with this. All right, come on. There we go. Back to the garage. Okay, let's go out here. Our car should be out here. Oops, wrong way. We'll just walk around. Yeah, we have a lot of work to get done on this thing. So this is pretty much before. I mean, there's not really much ru uh, rust on it. I see a lot of dirt. Okay, let's actually go in here and let's open up this thing real quick, though. Three and four, three and four. XP, there we go, we're up to level 14. And money, we could always use money. Okay, first things first, we're gonna take this over to the car wash and wash it real quick. See what we're actually working with. Wash. Yeah, see what I mean? Look at the body. There is no rust on this thing. Let's in, uh, detail inside. We got both seats in here. We need a steering wheel, it looks like. But everything else is, wow. Need some new wheels, of course. I don't even need to buy the other one. All right, so let's go and put it back into, let's take it to the shop. Yeah, let's take it to the shop. Okay, uh, first things first is I am going to take off the pieces. So, yeah, see, 61, we're going to take this off and try to repair. Well, those can't be repaired, but we're going to have to get new ones. Got to try to take this all off and try to repair as much as we can. Take that off, take that off, take that off, take this off. So we're trying to fully restore this thing. Be nice if we can keep the same color on everything. That off and that off. I think that's it. I don't see any other pieces really on the body. I mean, there's the interior seats. I don't think you can fix the interior stuff, but we can try. Let's see. Take this out. Oh, I didn't mean to sit in it. Let's. Oh, where is it at? Interior. There we go. Uh, there we go. Front left seat and front left seat. Okay. Let's go in here and see what we can actually fix. So back over to here. Okay, Salem trunk. This is that one we bought. 59. I mean, at least we can have an extra one, know what I mean? The hood's fixed. That was actually 39%. So that definitely needed to be fixed. Just that one. Mirror's fixed. So far, I've gotten every single thing fixed on here. Just gonna need some new windows. This is the other trunk. Yes, I didn't even need to buy that other one. Just that one. Mirror, and last is the door. Okay, so that is all fixed. Yes, yeah, I don't think you have fixed the interior stuff. Oh, this is this one. There we go, we got a new gearbox. Wait, wait, what was that gearbox anyways? Okay, let's see. That gearbox is an i4 SR20. i4 SR20, so gearbox. Let's uh, wait, go right, right over here. Gearbox, i4 SR20. 1,000, we only pay $900 for that. 800 and then what about 20 to 70 to actually fix it so yeah we actually got a good price for that that's actually a nissan one okay all right so let's actually put everything back in here um we do oops let me go to uh the inventory real quick let's go to where's it at interior where's the interior stuff at is it in here brake suspension engine probably right there okay let's um Add that to the shopping list, add that to the shopping list. And then we're also gonna have to pick out a steering wheel, so. So let's go over here, go to, where would that be under? Interiors, there we go. So shopping, oh, I forgot to erase all that. Oh well, 
So buy two of these. And then we also, dang it, keep pressing the wrong button. We also need a steering wheel, so. Where's the steering wheels at? Are they in here? Oh, there they are. Oh, uh, what should we go for? Um, hmm. <laughs> yeah, get one of those. Uh, steering wheel, fair ladies, GTR. Okay, do they have us have one for these? Let's see. Uh, Salem 1500. So let's look look up one for Salem 1500. Fair Lady, steering wheel two, six. I don't think they do. So let's just get something like this. The I well, know that's the Fair Lady ones. M three. Um, Typhoon Winchester. Let's try the Winchester. Let's see if we can actually put it in there. Okay, steering wheels. Oh yeah, we can. And then that and that look at that all right let's go back to here let's go to here and let's start putting everything back on so there's that oh yeah we're also going to get some windows wait i just want to check something out real quick hold on let me body tuning shop can you get oh we can bumpers you know what we're not gonna worry about it. we're gonna sell this car anyway so I know you probably get more money for it. Okay, we're gonna have to get a new license plate for it in a little bit too. Did we actually fix that left headlight? No, we didn't. We need headlights. License plates. There's a standard one. The fender. The front door. The right fender. Trunk, which we have two. Oh, no, 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 no. Get that one off. Okay, back to here, trunk. Okay, it shows the colors on them. Okay, there we go. Rear bumper. This fender. And license plate light. Okay, so what do we have left to get? I believe mirrors. Actually, windows. That's what we have to get. There's that one. Okay, so let's go into here. Let's go to... Body shop, we need front left window, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Okay. So let's go ahead. Oh, actually, I didn't even take out the front windshield. Oops. So take that one out. That was only 74%. Put this one in. That one. I didn't take this one out either. That one in, and let's put this one in. Look at that. Oh, wait. Oh, I forgot the headlights. Oops. Okay. Left headlight, right headlight. I don't think I took out the taillights either, so we're going to have to get some new taillights too. All right. Let's do that. How bad were those? 95 and 75. Okay, let's put the new ones in. 100 and 100. Okay, now time for the headlights. Okay, there we go right there. Wow, that's looking good. All right, go right here. Let's just take a look real quick. $19,000. Didn't we buy this for $18,000, though? Yeah, we bought it for $18,628. So we make a $1,000 profit. That's it. Ugh. Hey, but we still actually have a lot of work to get done on this thing. So let's bring this back up. Okay, let's hit you guys with the time lapse. We're gonna get finished with this.
Okay, so I think that is about it. I think we just have to fill up some fluids and that should be good to go. So let's go ahead and start filling up these fluids real quick. I have not taken a look at what price we're going to get for this. I'm hoping we will have at, have more than 66000 because I believe that's how much we had to start off with. So that is the main goal right there. Uh, let's see. Got this. I'm hoping I didn't miss anything. Okay, there's the windshield fluid. Then we got the power steering and coolant, and then that should be it. Well, I am also going to take this over to the test path so we can try to align the lights and then also try to align the wheels. And then we're going to take it to the test track, drive it for a minute, well, actually the speed one, and see how it runs, see how fast we can get up with this i6 engine. Okay, there's the last bit. There's the coolant. But yeah, this is a big transformation from the car, well, the truck we bought. Okay, right, that should be good enough. Oh, I forgot engine oil. Yep, that would probably help too, huh? So let's put some engine oil in it. Okay, we should have all the liquids. There we go. That should be good. All right, so let's go ahead, go ahead and take this over to the test path. Might actually change the color of this, maybe. Okay, the alignment. Yeah, I'm not very good at this. Oh, okay. Never mind. That's done. Okay, now wheel alignment. So let's go ahead and change this one. That's in the green. that's in the green and that's in the green all right so that's all good let's actually take this over to the paint shop i just want to take a look real quick see what colors we got over here um paint car oh that that is right there the factory color yeah let's just keep the factory color okay let me see if we can actually take this thing over to the not the racetrack we need the speed track there we go so our top speed was 139. Let's see if we can get this thing above 139. Okay. Here we go. Whew. So one truck done. This hopefully, I'm hoping we get like at least 70,000 off of this. Okay, so here we go. Okay, it's probably not going to be as fast as the other car. I mean, top speed on the thing says 100. Oh, actually, that's RPMs. Okay, we're already at 50. Wow, this thing's just almost 70 miles an hour in second gear. Wow. The speedometer on there, it looks like it says like 240. But I don't think this thing could do 240. Because I am barely able to get this thing over 85. Look at this. 90? Maybe, maybe if I would have upgraded the engine, maybe. Let's see. 94, can we get above 100? 96, 97, 8, and 9, 100. So we actually hit 100 on this thing. I think that's the end, so let's test out these brakes. Not bad brakes. Okay, so there we go right there. Let's go to return to garage, and let's see how much we can get for this thing. Come on. Oh, we're back in the paint booth. Let me actually bring this thing out to the garage entrance C. Okay. Final price for this is... Let's go to car status. So, let's see. 316,000 miles. Uh, let's see. Barn. Uh, how much horsepower is it? Uh, horsepower is only 145, so that makes sense right there. We could have probably did tuning, maybe some... Sw oh, I actually can't even swap the engine out of this. Wow. Okay. Um, there's that. $44,738. Let's sell it. And yeah, now we're up over $79,000. So we made about $14,000 in profit. Not bad. Okay, guys. So that is going to be the end of this episode. In the next episode, I am probably going to do a few more basically storylines get those all done and then maybe get a car from an auction 
So, remember, if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys do pound that like button. If you have a sun, make sure you guys do. Like always, have an amazing day, farmers. Peace. We got our windows down, driving down the 405.